Hey, everyone. We've been quiet for some time, since, like the rest of the world, we had some unforeseen hurdles to clear. But the wait is over. Let's dive into the open world of Dying Light 2. Got him. <laughs> the last slice of Dying Light 2 showcased the mission from the main storyline. You get out that old fuck. You saw how your decisions influenced the narrative and notably changed the environment. This time, we want to give you a broader look at the game and a sneak peek at some of the things we'll be talking Ooh. about in the upcoming months. Look how big it is. Wow. In Dying Light 2, you become Aiden Caldwell, an outsider trying to unravel a tangled mystery from his past. Its trail leads him to the city, probably the last bastion of mankind in the world. First, you feel like this intense, brutal place will tear you apart. But then you meet the Night Runners, veteran survivors who helped people in better days. Oh, from Hagan. You were a Night Runner. We used to help people, remember? Night Runners are gone. They're finished. A myth. And a little bit of Assassin's Creed, huh? Clear you can trust them. You need allies in the dark. These are the modern dark ages. It's been 15 years since the apocalypse and the world has changed. The old civilization has fallen, but a new one has been built on its ashes. People fight desperately for scarce resources. Rules are broken and weakness is punished. She's innocent. Ooh. Factions struggle for position in the city. Survivors pride themselves on being able to adapt to any circumstances and cobble together safe zones almost everywhere. Peacekeepers, loyal soldiers who want to impose their version of law and order and trample all in their path. Renegades, ex-prisoners serving their ruthless colonel, seeking to become sole rulers of the city. Where is Volus? Make him help us. Use these factions to reach your goal. Help or harm them to reshape the city to your liking. Just remember, each faction contains complex Ooh. characters. Nogi Parker, ain't ya? Got some kind of bad habit of yours? So, will you follow cold calculation or your heart? The Bazaar needs good people. Help us and you'll find a home here. Some in the city offer no chance for an alliance. Bandits, Yo, the crafting. Live only to plunder and kill, plunging the streets into chaos. I'm seeing a lot of new weapons you can craft. Yet, Nightfall scares all of them equally. My boy used to play nothing but at night. Like, that's the only time he would go out and search for stuff. Night only. Good night and good luck. Monsters crawl out of hiding to prey on the poor souls caught outside the safety of UV rays. Hordes of infected pour into the streets like decaying lava. The deadly spawn of 15 years of mutation and evolution. Ooh. Your only escape? Exploit the city's verticality and flee to the roofs. <laughs> or not go outside at night. <laughs> there, you are never safe from swift and deadly virals. Or even greater threat. Yet night brings opportunity as well. Nests rife with infected during the day now lie empty. To explore them, you must tread carefully. But those brave enough to face the terrors of the night can loot a jackpot.
as to the art of surviving. Luckily, you have all the tools you need to survive. Your extraordinary parkour skills allow you to navigate even the most treacherous terrain. <laughs> I used to love doing that. <laughs> you have to face your enemies head on. And then you have to be smart, resourceful, and determined. We've worked hard on the essence of our combat, making sure swinging a big, meaty weapon is fun, satisfying, and well executed. But even the most brutal fights can be tactical as well. You have multiple ways to hone your skills toward the gameplay style that suits you best. It's up to you if you focus mostly on mobility and parkour, or aggressive, blunt force combat, or a crafty approach where the tools you've created get the job done. Every ability you learn Ooh, that was dope. possibly a new favorite move. Things move fast and quick in Dying Light 2. Each moment matters. Each move could mean triumph or defeat. Choose your actions and friends carefully. Everything you do in the city can reshape the gameplay environment, change the course of the narrative, and decide the fate of the city's oh. residents. But most importantly, you decide your own fate as well. You're about to turn. Make sure to stay human. Y'all playing games. Okay, so the last and arguably the most important question I'm sure you have is when is the release? Yes, release date. Very, 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 very important question. And luckily, we have the answer. And that answer is the, the 7th, 7th of December. December. <laughs> Yay. Waited years to say that out loud. December 7th. <laughs> it's coming home. It's time for you to go pre-order it. Go to dyinglight.com slash pre-order. Select your platform. And yes. Pre-order. It's getting paid you for. Congratulations. You just pre-ordered one of the most anticipated games of this year. Go you. Yes. Oh, wow. Oh, 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 oh. It's coming home. Well, I've got good news for you then, because this official figurine is part of the collector's edition of Dying Light. The collector Light. edition. You can get one for yourself if you want. Hmm. Uh, we'll leave like a, a proper unboxing of the whole set for the professionals. But uh, we do have it all in front of us right now, so it'd be rude not to take a look. Uh, you get in the Hold up. Edition, Hold up. A concept art book full of stunning artwork from the game. I gotta put. I gotta look uh, it up right quick. Which will have your game inside it, of course. Mm -hmm. uh, and you get this uh, interesting little sort of UV flashlight. So oh, yeah, cool. cool. It looks like there's all sorts of vanity elements in here too, like some legendary skin packs, uh, as well as all sorts of digital elements. Uh, and for more information on these digital elements, uh, please visit the pre-order website. I want this, and I want Dying Light too. I kind of thought you'd say that. Well, if you're feeling the same way, then uh, I've got good news because you can pre-order the collector's edition. However, it is very, very limited, so you'll have to be very quick. Mm -hmm. well, rest assured, there will be plenty of the standard edition for your standard gamer. But if you're into special editions, there is a deluxe edition of Dying Light 2 with a steel book, a legendary pack, and a we don't want that. Track, and much, much more. So to summarize, that's three different editions that you can buy depending on what you're after. And if you just can't wait until release to get immersed in the world of Dying Light 2, then why don't you go check out the Techland Gamers and Goodies website for more info. Yeah, this is a program for all gamers. Whether or not you want updates on Dying Light 2 with the news, or you want Dying Light 2 items in Dying Light 1, everyone's going to find something they like there. Yep, and uh, this is just an initial offering as well. Check back later for even more details, more information, and we'll be going through it in future episodes as well. That's it. Don't forget to pre-order the game. It's not up for the um, collector edition to be pre-ordered just yet. And here's a sneak peek not even a the price. of the next episode. Thank you for watching and stay safe out there. Bye. See ya. <laughs> yo, yo, let's go. December 7th. Man. I am hype.
I am hype. Yes. Yes, we have an official release date. There it is, you guys. Yes, we need this. We need this. All right, you guys, let me know what you guys think in the comments about Dying Light 2, the information they gave. Wow. The city is bigger. Parkour, 3,000 parkour moves. Oh, man. This is this was definitely worth the wait of, of just everything with Dying Light. I'm speechless. I am excited. And, yeah, I'm about to sit here and click refresh because I want this pre-order edition this um collector edition but shout out to everybody that's checking out the video with me thank you guys and yeah until the next time i will holla at y'all y'all be safe much love oh and y'all know the drill like the video hit the like subscribe all right i'll holla at y'all man peace out